Hey guys, uh, welcome back. Today we're gonna be talking about how to make live augmented reality face uh, tracking in Swift. And also, you need to know oh, there always there's a link to source code in comments. Okay, let's start our project. Uh, but before that, uh, you can see uh, output of our app. So you will see we will detect face live uh, and we place a mask uh, actually with uh, one more than 1000 dot over the face so uh, in next video if you will subscribe you will see that you know how step by step we will detect all the part of the face and uh, we can place something over them or try to uh, change them uh, with uh, even you can place a texture over uh, this mask so uh, we will do a lot so just be subscribed to learn more okay uh, let's moving forward here you go let's uh, go to our Xcode file new project and uh, here yeah we will choose single view app iOS Swift AR Kit Face Tracking 02. Yeah, place it here. I already have one, so I will uh, probably uh, get uh, error. Yeah, no, uh, it's a uh, new one, so yeah, 02. Okay, so uh, we will go to main storyboard right away because we want to make it an AR kit project. And uh, so I will select the main storyboard. And then uh, I'll select my view here. And I come to identity inspector and here I make my class uh, to be AR scene view that's it so we make it now one AR kit project of course we need to import uh, AR kit as well but uh, before that uh, let me connect this view so from this view I'm gonna control drag to my project and I name it scene view okay now I close the assistant editor and I'll go to view controller so to uh, here you will see that I got error uh, uh, from this uh, because it's not declared yes uh, to fix this I'm gonna import my AR kit and this will go and here I just say okay my scene delegate equals self always make sure when you use a delegate protocol make sure to do this because we need to make this view controller a delegate for our kids but it's a uh, yeah it's not extended yes because uh, we can either put uh, delegates uh, scene view delegate here or we can do extension so I'll choose this one so I just say extension for my view controller with protocol ARS Yeah, view scene view delegate and uh, yeah here we go so that one uh, should go the other error uh, but I want to do something quickly here so uh, first of all uh, yeah let me uh, pick up uh, from um, codes that I already typed before to speed up this uh, tutorial uh, yeah, here you will see I uh, just uh, make configuration and then I make a session to run this configuration 
uh, in uh, view will appear and uh, in view disappear I just pause that and you also you will see that I called super uh, view will appear uh, which is our parent uh, we get it from uh, AR kit and run it and then I'll do my customization also uh, here uh, just one guard here in my view did load and say if uh, it uh, device did not support so what is this is for because uh, this app will only work on iPhone X or iPhone 10 which have a 3d face detector which is using for face ID the other device cannot support so we will, with this one we will handle that one and avoid our project to be crash okay uh, let's go to extension so in extension we will have two uh, methods actually two definition of uh, render uh, I'll go uh, one by one over them so the first one it's render for a node so by this one we will place our mask over the face so we already ARK already detect the face uh, and so this one gonna get the device and then make a face uh, geometry and then add a node for that one and over that node the uh, place our uh, you know um, you know connect them you know those dots with line together here you will see uh, I have two options uh, if I type that I can fill it or I can use lines so I use lines and uh, yeah uh, the other one it's for motion so this one gonna render face and updates our mask uh, with uh, motion over face so we will get okay face uh, Enter, uh, make from Ace uh, AR face enter. Maybe use that one, and uh, for face also, uh, which this means that I say guard let this one, and again guard let so inside that one. So I use uh, this semicolon uh, here to call uh, to do this uh, together. Something like and. So face uh, geometry gonna be no dot geometry as this one, and then. Uh, I'm gonna update this face geometry. So uh, we almost done. Oh, we we missed uh, something very important. So in in info p list, we need to make sure to add privacy for camera usage. So uh, I'll go to privacy and uh, here in I believe in top yeah camera device. Uh, so for camera, we need to give description to user while the first time they're gonna use this they get this warning and then they can acknowledge so needs access to camera yeah so our app whatever you name it need access to camera okay let's uh, run project but uh, here uh, it's over simulator I'm gonna say okay no I don't want to be on the, from here either or you can come to uh, the targets uh, I believe yeah here in product destination and you can choose uh, your uh, device it should be one uh, iPhone 10 but uh, you will see that I get something uh, that says it's not supporting yes uh, because my phone already has iPhone uh, you know uh, my phone has uh, iOS 12 and but this project looking for iOS 12.1 uh, so as soon as I make this 12 it's gonna go but here I'll see another error which is because of the uh, requesting one for one ID it's uh, gonna be free you can go to iTunes and make one or even here yeah you know you can add new account uh, so you will go and pick up uh, one of the your accounts uh, and uh, 
do it uh, you know you will uh, you just need to get uh, make sure to have this automatically managing signing and then we can uh, start to run but it's not end of the story because uh, in your device uh, you need you uh, need to give access to this for the first time uh, so let me while it's running uh, let me go and yeah here you go uh, I you will see my device and uh, we are waiting for acknowledge yes uh, running iOS on iPhone so it's coming soon here yeah here you go Usually for first run, uh, you need to uh, acknowledge uh, that, uh, yes, here, that, uh, you know, this is exactly needs access to the camera. Uh, so for uh, user need to acknowledge based on the privacy. And uh, yeah, as soon as uh, you will have uh, run it, uh, you will see that it's working. Uh, we have again mask over my face and uh, you will see even this mask can detect uh, my mouth and eyes uh, motions yeah that's it uh, for today i hope you like it uh, if you like it uh, please make sure to give it a thumbs up uh, also don't forget to be subscribed because the next videos are coming for more on this ar kit also other cool subjects and uh, if you have any question please ask in the comments i will be more than happy to help i wish the best for you and have a great one bye bye